place where we have the world's biggest earthquakes and the world's biggest tsunamis. So the Southwest Pacific countries are at huge risk of tsunami. The Kermit Trench that goes up right and weaves around Tonga poses the most significant threat, not just to New Zealand, but all of the smaller South Pacific islands and territories. Dark buoy is a system. It's not just a buoy floating on top of the surface of the ocean, but it's also a sensor on the seafloor. Then it's tethered to a buoy sitting on the surface. The pressure sensor on the seafloor then communicates with a recorder telecommunications on the buoy when that tsunami it goes over the sensor. It can measure how big that tsunami was. It was key for us to ensure that what we were developing would also be useful for other countries in the Pacific that will be using information from the dark buoy. The dark boys will provide them with extra knowledge on where the wave is coming from and how long they've got. We know that the best way to keep people safe from tsunamis is to keep them educated and prepared for tsunamis that will happen around the Pacific. Tsunami ready means that when that does happen, that community is prepared for it and can take the appropriate action. Through the Pacific Tsunami Warning System, we have a strategy which outlines how we want to achieve certain goals within the next 10 years. And what we've done in the Pacific is align our strategy with the UN decade, which goal is to have safer oceans by 2030. So we're making sure that all of the work that we do with regard to understanding tsunami risk and then planning for that risk is aligned with the outcomes of the decade, which is to have 100% resilient communities at risk of tsunami.